summary Raquel Levis is suing Tom and Ariana for image-based sexual abuse and emotional distress after the fallout of Scandaval. Tom recorded their intimate FaceTime calls without Raquel's consent, leading to mental health decline and legal action. Raquel blames not only Tom and Ariana but also the Vanderpump Rules cast and crew for her decline after the scandal. Vanderpump Rules star Rachel Raquel Levis has decided to pursue legal action against Tom Sandoval and Ariana Maddox after the fallout from Scandoval changed her life completely, and many are wondering what her lawsuit entails. Raquel, who was engaged to James Kennedy during her time on Vanderpump Rules, spent several years on the series building relationships with the rest of the cast. Tom and Ariana, who began dating after Vanderpump Rules Season 2, befriended both James and Raquel despite issues they'd faced in the past. When it was uncovered that Tom and Raquel had been engaging in an affair, everything changed. Raquel's affair with Tom has been public fodder since early March 2023, when it was revealed to the public just hours after Ariana discovered the secret tryst. In the months that followed, both Tom and Raquel were dragged on social media and brought to the court of public opinion, where they were slammed for their actions and inability to take accountability. Tom had the opportunity to appear on The Masked Singer and Special Forces, World's Toughest Test, while Raquel was treated so harshly in the media that she checked into a mental health facility in Arizona to care for herself. Related 20 Best Reality TV Shows Right Now Television is being impacted by the ongoing entertainment industry strikes, leaving many turning to reality TV. What are the best shows right now? Raquel is suing Tom and Ariana for personal reasons on February 29, 2024. It was revealed that Raquel would be suing both Tom and Ariana in a suit that claims the exes were responsible for major damages after their mutual scandal. According to Deadline, Raquel is suing Tom and Ariana for image-based sexual abuse along with eavesdropping, invasion of privacy, and intentional infliction of emotional distress. The claims Raquel has made detail the issues she has faced after the fallout of Scandaval made global news, which made it impossible for her to function normally. Raquel shared in the documents just how much pain she's felt throughout the media frenzy. Explaining that Tom, recorded sexually explicit videos of her without her knowledge or consent, Raquel revealed that the entirety of Scandaval broke because of a screen recording. On top of Tom's clear role in the scandal, Raquel shared her view of the scandal paints Ariana out to be a villain, as well. Claiming the Vanderpump Rules Season 11 star, distributed, disseminated, and discussed the videos publicly, Raquel's team describes Ariana as a scorned woman seeking vengeance, catalyzing the scandal. While she takes responsibility for her part of the scandal, Raquel is hoping for acknowledgement that others are also at fault. Raquel didn't know Tom was recording their intimate FaceTime calls close Raquel's legal documents outline the events of Scandaval, pointing out a huge issue in the way Tom was conducting himself during their affair. Sharing that their FaceTime calls had been screen recorded, Raquel's documentation explains that she had no prior knowledge that the videos were being recorded, and she'd never given Tom consent to do so. The legal documents explain that, Levis was a victim of the predatory and dishonest behavior of an older man. Tom, who is in his early 40s, was engaging in an affair with 29-year-old Raquel and actively withholding the proof of said affair for himself. 
proof of the affair was the reason Ariana wound up discovering Tom was cheating on her in the first place, but the fact that he had it at all was troubling. A form of sexual abuse, Tom holding the power in having recordings of his sexually explicit FaceTime calls with Raquel could get him into some extreme trouble. For Ariana, the fact that she's spoken publicly about the recordings and, according to Raquel's legal team, distributed them is also an issue. While Ariana isn't at fault for taking action, she could be held liable for damage to Raquel's mental health. Raquel's mental state declined after the public drama of Scandaval although Raquel's mental health was likely not at its best prior to Scandaval becoming international news, the impact the scandal had on her was tremendous and sent her into an entirely different headspace. The legal documentation explains that Raquel, ultimately checked herself into a mental health facility and remained there for three months while Bravo, Evolution, and the cast milked the interest her excoriation had piqued. While Raquel was in treatment, doing everything possible to improve her difficult mental state, those behind the series and in front of the cameras were trying to make her into an even larger villain. Raquel is including Ariana in the lawsuit for defamation close Raquel had a huge part in destroying Tom and Ariana's relationship, as well as her friendship with the rest of the Vanderpump Rules cast, but she is sharing in her legal documentation that she doesn't feel like it's been clear she's not the only person responsible. In the legal documentation, Raquel's team explains that Ariana was a huge part of causing her harm, hoping to capitalize off the damage that had been done to her. Explaining that Ariana has enjoyed unseen levels of public recognition and professional opportunity, post Scandaval, Raquel has been fighting to keep herself afloat personally and professionally. In the legal documentation, Raquel's team explains that Ariana's distribution and public vitriol surrounding the other woman made it difficult for her to continue on. While Ariana was speaking out about the affair in every avenue possible, Raquel was in a mental health facility trying to understand the full impact of her decisions. While Ariana has continued to speak on Tom, it appears she has moved on from discussing Raquel. According to the legal documents, Raquel, was humiliated and villainized for public consumption, remains a shell of her former self, with her career prospects stunted and her reputation in tatters. Raquel blames the Vanderpump Rules producers cast for her decline although Tom and Ariana are named explicitly in the documentation, Raquel has issues with the rest of the Vanderpump Rules cast and crew, as well. She shared that she'd been, misled by Bravo and Evolution into believing that she was contractually barred from speaking out about her mistreatment. Believing that she had to be silent about the way Tom, Ariana, and the rest of the Vanderpump Rules cast was treating her publicly, Raquel suffered as Vanderpump Rules soared to new heights, gaining global praise and recognition for the way it handled the incredibly sensitive subject matter. Will Raquel's lawsuit be successful? Although it's far too soon to say whether or not Raquel's lawsuit will be successful, it's already made major waves with the Vanderpump Rules cast. In speaking out about the fact that she feels that Scandaval was treated without care or compassion, Raquel has finally been able to speak her truth about the public scandal that dragged her through the mud. Raquel, who is no longer a cast member on Vanderpump Rules, may have been at fault for engaging in an affair with Tom, but has been treated horrendously for her behavior and could ultimately be rewarded for speaking up. Vanderpump Rules airs Tuesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Bravo, then streams the following day on Peacock. Source. Deadline.